We've been married eight years. You've been to jail, what, three times in eight years? Shirley Strawberry was on a phone call with her husband in this conversation. And there were a couple of other comments that she made. Let me say this, that wasn't funny. In a world enveloped in the gloss and glam of celebrity life, the echoing revelations around Shirley Strawberry jolt us into a confronting reality behind the charismatic voice of the Steve Harvey Morning Show. We're about to peel back the curtain on a life beset with financial woes and simmering resentments, presenting a stark dichotomy between public facade and private tumult. You can't be moving like you're moving and your stuff isn't in order, you know? These words from the leaked conversation evoke the turmoil swathing Shirley's life, highlighting the constant legal battles and dwindling fortune, a stark reality masked by the shimmer of the spotlight. I haven't gone to the mall to get some shoes or ordered them or anything, but I don't know if I can because I'm running out of money. Behind the curtain, the unfolding narrative reveals Shirley, caught in the whirlwind of a strained marriage with the incarcerated Ernesto Williams and mounting financial despair, all while harboring underlying tensions with the iconic Steve Harvey. This clandestine conversation from October 2022 offers us a glimpse into Shirley's reality, a distressing tableau marked by a drained fortune and a life submerged in chaos. I'm not rich. <laughs> no, I didn't say that. You should be able to go get you some shoes now. Navigating through the intimate recesses of her life, we are beckoned into the detailed intricacies of her strained relationships, her financial struggles emphasized by her professed inability to afford even shoes. You've got to get this stuff taken care of. It's a lot on me. It's a lot on you too. I know, but this is a lot. Her words resonate with the weight of her crumbling world, revealing a marriage haunted by frequent incarcerations and a turbulent relationship reaching its boiling point with declarations of divorce and allegations of divorce and allegations of infidelity. Sometimes when your friends or people you love are going through it and they start talking, sometimes you, they just want you to listen. This exploration promises a closer look at the profound repercussions these revelations hold for Shirley delving into the threads of deteriorated camaraderie and silent battles that have marred her professional and personal life. So brace yourselves as we unfold the myriad of intricate details and underlying tensions that surround the life of Shirley Strawberry, exploring the web of rumors, facts, and speculations that entwine her existence. In this unraveling saga, the essence of Shirley Strawberry's current situation, dominated by financial struggles, marital turmoil, and her husband, Ernesto Williams incarceration, has left fans and audiences in utter shock. Her long-standing partnership with Steve Harvey since the early 2000s in the celebrated radio show and her signature advice segment, Strawberry Letter, seemed to portray a harmonious life where Shirley provided guidance to many who found themselves tangled in life's intricate web. However, a series of events has pulled back the curtain revealing a reality filled with distress and deception, much of it centered around her husband's legal troubles and alleged fraud schemes, uncovering a side of her life that contrasts sharply with the advice she offers. Uh, I have an affidavit. His wife um, is, a, is a person of some uh, public notoriety. The additional charges pressed against Williams, trafficking and theft, underscore the severe gravity of his actions, painting a disturbing image of a man once deemed as Shirley's significant other. He cannot be around Shirley's daughter, who is said to be a victim of his, Shirley's grandchildren, who are said to be victims of his. These shocking revelations, coupled with the surfacing of her financial strains evident in leaked phone calls where she confesses to struggling to buy shoes due to extensive legal fees, have highlighted the dichotomy between her public persona and private life. In one of the phone conversations, Shirley's concern and frustration are palpable. But yeah, when you get out hey, there, we gotta just get all this stuff in order. This is just too much, too much, she tells Ernesto, her voice steeped in the stress of dealing with his recurring incarcerations and accumulating legal dilemmas. Now, let us delve deeper into Shirley's financial and emotional turmoil. Shirley's ordeal serves as a stark representation of concealed conflicts and lingering pressures. The conflict becomes even more poignant considering her role as a giver of advice and now finding herself ensnared in a situation similar to those she counseled. Her revelation about running out of money due to paying for Ernesto has unveiled a troubling facet of her marriage, spotlighting the depth of her crisis as she seemingly struggles to uphold the facade of normalcy for her audience and herself. The divulgence of her financial constraints and Ernesto's shocking betrayals has had an echoing impact, spurring debates and discussions among fans and critics alike, putting her credibility in a precarious position. Analyzing the leaked conversations and the subsequent events, the complexities in Shirley's situation appear to revolve around not only her husband's betrayals, but also the emotional and financial toll it is imposing on her. Ernesto's flings and flirtations, notably with a woman named Sonia, further intensify the atmosphere of betrayal surrounding Shirley, who remains burdened by his legal fees. Doubt the lady in the rented house next door is Ernest's girlfriend slash business partner slash 
I don't know what else. These unveilings lead to a more nuanced understanding of her predicament, showcasing a side of her relationship dynamics that was once securely hidden from public scrutiny. Our inquiry into the tensions between Shirley and Steve Harvey uncovers yet another layer in this multifaceted scenario. Shirley's leaked comments about Steve and his wife, Marjorie, expose a strain in their long-standing friendship and professional partnership. You heard me say that you got winded going up the stairs in your home and that Marjorie looks at us as the help, she said, later extending a public apology for her words, emphasizing the regret in her voice. It's just hard for me to bring this particular thing up. I, I was just so embarrassed. This controversy raises questions about the longevity and future of their collaboration, especially in the wake of her personal calamities. The Shirley Strawberry saga, marked by familial discord, financial turbulence, and tarnished friendships, provides a stark reflection of concealed realities behind public facades. As we continue to delve into the preceding rumors and backgrounds, we aim to bring more clarity to the intertwined relationships, subtle tensions, and concealed truths surrounding her life, giving our audiences a comprehensive insight into the life of a personality they thought they knew. Before the detailed leaks, whispers were already indicating possible conflicts between Shirley Strawberry and Steve Harvey. Their long-standing alliance, seemingly solid since the early 2000s, appeared to mask subtle tensions and concealed disagreements, especially when Shirley's personal life faced turmoil due to her husband's legal troubles. A leaked conversation in October 2022 between Strawberry and Williams exposed subtle tensions and revealed disparities and possible conflicts within their professional and personal and personal relationships, hinting at deeper unresolved issues and potential orchestrated sidelining by Harvey to protect his image and lifestyle. Post-revelation, the leaked conversation brought more speculative theories regarding the dynamics within the Harvey household to the surface. The rumor mills are swirling with theories that Steve is consciously letting Shirley struggle to isolate her from the show, shared an anonymous source. The public, dissecting every piece of information, has been linking them to previous rumors, speculating on possible truths hidden behind the glamour, exploring conjectures about concealed animosities within the Harvey Strawberry relationships. The hidden realities and speculated truths in their camaraderie seem to be revealing a myriad of intrigues and deeper tribulations within their personal and professional and professional lives. Delving deeper into the ramifications of the mounting friction between Shirley Strawberry and Steve Harvey, it is clear how profoundly this altercation has reverberated through their professional endeavors and initiatives. The resultant atmosphere is reminiscent of prior industry rifts, like when two prominent stars found themselves embroiled in disputes impacting their careers. It was evident that when celebrities engage in public feuds, it invariably bleeds into their professional life, tarnishing reputations and relationships, as recounted by an entertainment industry insider. Comparatively, other celebrities, enduring analogous repercussions, have seen their images and projects suffer, reflecting a ubiquitous pattern in the showbiz domain. Such analogous circumstances echo the same strains in public scrutiny, revealing that these conflicts are not singular, but part of a recurring trend within the industry. As one celebrity in a past similar feud had noted, the backlash in public opinion can be overwhelming, and it often dictates the trajectory of one's career post-conflict, emphasizing the substantial consequences that such public disagreements can levy on celebrities' professional trajectories. As the tide of public opinion swells in the wake of these revelations, a diverse spectrum of reactions from fans, critics, and fellow celebrities emerges on various social media platforms some fans are expressing concern and empathy towards Strawberry, stating, I do not wish her any harm at all because she has definitely been through enough. However, she really has no business conducting any kind of radio segment to give relationship advice. Make it stop. The sentiments are an amalgamation of sympathy and critical evaluation, reflecting the mixed feelings the public holds towards the ongoing scenario. Conversely, others are absorbed in the unfolding drama, confessing this soap opera has made me trust no one even more. This is so sad and depressing, but it has me hooked. And some show frustration towards other involved parties, particularly Ernesto, with remarks such as, it annoys me how Ernesto was acting like he is clueless about the severity of his case. I'm sure his lawyer has informed him by now about those charges involving children and animals. These assorted reactions manifest the division and varying perspectives amongst the audience, highlighting the extensive impact and intrigue the ongoing controversy has generated, setting the stage for further development and revelations in this unfolding narrative. In light of the escalating animosity and public disputes surrounding Shirley Strawberry and Steve Harvey, we've witnessed their professional landscapes shift dramatically, resonating with prior instances of celebrity disputes. The public, inundated with diverse reactions, remains divided, generating a spectrum of empathy, intrigue, and criticism. The ongoing discord, as encapsulated by reactions and speculations, has painted a complex picture of professional rivalry, personal anguish, and public scrutiny it beckons contemplation on how these unfolding events might further evolve, steering the course of their careers and public personas, with potential revelations poised to reshape public perceptions and professional alliances. 
And now we post to you, our astute viewers, could there be more to this tangled web than meets the eye? What are your thoughts on the unfolding drama and how do you foresee it impacting the lives and careers of those involved? Your insights are invaluable and we eagerly await your perspectives in the comments below. Until the next scoop unfolds, stay tuned and keep the conversations buzzing. Goodbye and keep the gossip lively.